Let me show you how to find the line tool in Affinity Publisher. The line tool is a bit hidden because it has the option for pen tool. So first you need to select a pen tool from the list on the left. And then we need to activate line mode. In modes, there's the one over here called line mode. After you do that, you will be able to use pen tool to draw lines just like that. It's perfect for straight lines. And keep in mind, they're all vector lines, so if you switch to the node tool, you can always adjust those nodes, change how long is the line, how straight it is. And in addition, we can also switch to stroke tab on the right side this time, decide how thick the line should be. You can decide on the starting point, if you plan to use this line as arrow, that's possible as well. And we can also change the line to the dash line from here and customize the gap between those dashes over there. If you would like a curvy line, then the process is rather similar. We grab a pen tool. But this time we are not going to use the line mode. Use the normal pen mode. When you click and hold, click and hold, now you are creating curvy line. The trick is not to just click to make a node, click and hold it so you can move those control points. When you release, that's it. But you can still grab the node tool after that and Adjust those, those control points or even grab the line itself. Take a look. I can just simply grab the line. Let's also switch off those arrowheads, go back to normal line and test the last feature that we can set up here called pressure. I click on pressure here. I can mimic the pen pressure. For example, I can put more pressure at the center of the line. And it will be more like hand draw, more natural. Or other way around, we can make a minimal pressure at the center of the line. So it will look more like an uh, ink. All right, so we can play with pressure as well to mimic more like a natural digital art style of the line. If you don't want that, simply hit reset in the pressure section. All right, so we know how to make straight lines. We know how to make curvy lines. How about more complex lines? Go with the pen tool. You can keep clicking to create a, a polygonal line like that. If you want to align everything nicely, just select those nodes and use the alignment panel at the top over here. Align to the same line and also we can space it. Unfortunately, this kind of disrupt our nodes, turn them into curvy lines, but we can convert them by into sharp nodes. Okay, and the bottom will be the same. Align, space it, convert back to sharp nodes. And we got very nice a zigzag line as well. We already learned how to do a curvy line like this. This kind of line is perfect to apply some pressure on it. And as I show you at the beginning of this video, you can also turn on the line mode in the pen tool. If you want to draw multiple lines just like that. All right, I hope this short tutorial was helpful. You can learn more about Affinity Publisher in the next video.